Hi everyone, welcome to another episode of Kevin Plays Lotro. Today we are continue, continuing on with the Brawler slash Race of Man introduction. And I believe these quests, we are trying to find out what's happening with the farmhands and we need to collect some materials as well. And then we'll go back and, and finish up the uh, intro and see if we could fight these black walls. All right, enjoy, and I like also like to invite you if you like this video in the series, hit that like, subscribe, and bell notification, and let's get to it. Dead, murdered by by the black wolves. Also murdered. Oh, we got some dangerous mobs over here. Oh, we got a black wool and okay, and he is red, so they will attack. So <clears throat> not everything is yellow in the intro. So I was wrong about that. Alright. I thought I already got the other. There was another one over here. Uh oh, black wool. Well, fine. Take that. All right. Old blood task. You know, there's no quest to get them. Not that I know of. But we'll get them anyway. Build up our metal. There we go. All right. Let's see if we can find. Oh, Walt. Whit oh, Walt Whitley's that way. Oh, he's over this way. Oh, here's a bilberry bush. Two, two bunches of bilberries. Ha 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 ha. Oh. All right. There he is, right next to that black wolf. See if I could get around him. All right. Murdered as well. All right, so we're going to do set that as quest guy focus. And we'll, this is obviously the Black Wolves hideout here. We'll, we'll be going back in there later. All right. There's a bush right there. He's yellow. Three. Three bunches of bilberries. And here's four. Four bunches of bilberries. All right, now we're going to go to comb. Says quest guide and plead for help. Let's get some help from comb. Please. Please come to our chat and save us. Please. Oh, I guess we could turn in the quest we've already done. <clears throat> Let's see what this is. See what he says. What can I do for you? No, it cannot be my poor father and the others. No, it cannot be. It cannot. Will is silent for a long moment, his eyes closed, but after a great pause, he is roused. I will have my revenge upon those black walls, or I will die trying. Archet will never fall to such murderous fiends. So, I'm just going to grab a a blade 
and then I'm gonna sell it. Oh, let's go ahead and uh, loot all that, and see if we can sell them. Greetings, here. friend. Yes. So home blade, we'll sell that. Uh, all those are my cosmetics. Sell that. Sell that. Sell that. If you accidentally sell everything, you could click on buy back and buy it back. But but that's that's only for um, so long. I think maybe when you log out, you might lose it. I don't know. So, oh, broken short sword. Let's sell that. All right. <clears throat> All right, let's go to comb. So we are going, we are right here, we're going here, that's the gate to comb. And the little quest ring is uh, telling us where to go. Here's the gate. And look at all those black wolves. The gate is blocked. Arch is on his own now. Ha ha ha. Do you want the people of... What does it say? You're afraid of the black wolves, are ya? Best run home, little fool. Enjoy your day. It'll be your last. Yeah. And this guy, he first said... Uh, da da da. You're... Oh. Arch is on his own now. Hmm. Yeah, you can't even fight him. Nope. Anyway. So we better return to Cal Springley with the dire news. This cannot be. Pup I must try to Brackenbrook at once. No, it cannot be. My men traveled to Comb only late yesterday for a delivery. This is bad news, Cobra Kai. The captain must be informed of what's going on at once. Here is a note for Brackenbrook. He knows my scrawl. He will believe you now. All right. Let's read the letter. Let's be nosy and read the letter. Dear Captain Brackenbrook, Brook, my farm was attacked by black wolves this morning. They are organized and they are armed. I and a few of my men managed to stave them off, but something dark is stirring in a way I have never seen. They have cut off the road to comb. We can't get out and no help can come in. Please make yourself ready for all-out war. These are not the ruffians we know, Cal. All right. Well, hopefully... Hopefully he'll listen now, because we have a letter from someone that he trusts. Oh, come on. Come on, come on. What, what, what's going on here? That was weird. Come on, come on. We need to run and kick him in the head. There we go. Yeah, slap him. All right, there we go. All right. 
Brackenbrook will believe me now. As Brackenbrook reads the letter from Cal Springley, his face is blank. He reads it a second time, and only then does he look at you. I have been a fool. Oh, what have I done? All right. So we want the leggings. Yep, heavy armor. So we'll select that finish. You cannot I received a new title. Me. I have been. All right. So if you want to look at the titles titles so I could do Cobra Kai of Gondor and then these are from Helm's Deep when you buy um, get the expansion I don't know if the the expansion you get now includes this but when it first came out it did and oh the worry this is the new one I've reached level 5 without being defeated in battle okay I don't want to put up Gondor because uh, you know he's been run out of town all right so where are we at equip that and then we'll use these cuz yeah no nah I kinda like those are cool looking boots though but oh leggings yeah so we'll use leggings as our cosmetic there we go much better alright okay you cannot fathom just how wrong I have been I have trusted Calder Cobb and heeded his advice for a long time even after my own son tried to warn me of his duplicity my son John is a worthy hunter but he has not set foot in this town for over three years he will never forgive me for the things I said to him Oh, what a fool I am. I told him he was not welcome in Archon until he stopped behaving like a jealous child. Now he and his hunters are our only hope. But what can I do? He does not deserve to be dragged deeper into my folly. Nay, Archon must withstand the storm without help. So Brackenbrook is hopeless. You should ask Strider what to do. All right. Let's see what he if he has more to say. What does he say? Nay, I will not ask John to come to our aid. I am not worthy to ask favors of my son. I will fall with Archet. Uh huh. All right. Where's Strider? There he is. <clears throat> Do not despair. You have done well. Indeed, better than I could have done. You've earned Captain Brackenbrook's trust. You must appeal to his son John against his wishes. I must leave soon, and Archet will need all the help it can get even if a father's pride is at stake. I am confident you'll be able to bring the hunters in and give this town a fighting chance. In the meantime, I must make haste. Amdir assures me he just needs rest. No, you need to get him healed, dude. Ask the exiled hunter to come to Archit's aid. Okay. So, oh, and we got to bring the hobbits there. Lunch and tea and all that stuff. So, okay. Lovely. This is sure to cheer on to your right up. Yes, you have found more than enough to, for a good strong tea. This is sure to cheer Amdir right up. Give me a moment and I will steep the berries in some boiling water. And we get some fried mushrooms, which is agility which does not help us so we'll finish and then here let me show you something so see agility as a uh, increases my parry rating and evade rating so it would help us if we eat those for a moment but here might might is very important for for you might increases your physical mastery finesse evade and parry ratings so when you look at armor with stats and whatnot you want to get the armor with might which is uh, um, basically heavy armor uh, medium armor is agility and light armor is will which is basically tact 
tactical mastery which is basically spells and magic users and all that stuff so we we don't need that at all so we want might armor which is the heavy heavy uh, armor stuff so see and here's physical mastery right here increases melee dam damage and range damage and tactical mastery increase well tactical damage which is basically spells and whatnot okay so, but we don't use magic, so that doesn't nothing for us. This tea will help on beer feel better. Uh, I just know it. Okay, doesn't the bilberry tea smell delightful? It still reminds me of my gammer who made this for me when I was under the weather, even though my gammer is long gone. You are such a dear to collect those wild berries for me, so I shan't be taking all the credit. Why don't you bring this nice brute to Amdir so he can thank you himself? You make sure he drinks it all up. Okay, what do we get with this old ring? One mice, so that will help us. All right. All right, Mundo Beggins. This will do nicely. It Hooray! Gives me to munch on for a bit, at least. You brought me pork or bacon or perhaps sausage. Oh, it doesn't matter. I can make a little of each. Mundo weighs the parcel of meats in his hands. This will give me something to munch on for a bit. Hopefully this provender will last me until I can go back home. Okay, and then, of course, this is just a copper band. We can sell that. Okay. All right, so we'll give Amdir the tea. I thank you, but I have not the stomach to drink this now. Does that tea smell of bilberries? That was very sweet of Calendine, and very good of you to fetch her the m makings. I am all the sorrier, for I cannot drink this now. I, I do not feel well enough just now. I will pretend to drink it. You must tell Calendine I enjoyed her tea. Please do not let her know that her kindness was wasted on me. Oh, and we're going to lie to Calendine. Poor little Did my tea puck him What up? the heck I is... Knew it would. Oh, that's a chicken. I thought that was Mundo for a second, like on the ground rolling around or something. I'm like, what the heck is that hobbit doing? But he's right there. Okay. Mm -hmm. Did that tea perk him up? I knew it would. Bilberry tea always fixes me right up, and I know it would be especially sweet if it came from both of us. Cobra Kai. I know Amder will be back on his feet soon. He is so brave. All right. So we will equip that old ring, which I guess I could just I just do right, and yeah, went to the first slot, first finger slot. All right, yeah, all right. Where are we going? Exile hunter. So that hunter M is right here over in the hunting lodge. So we'll. I think we could cross. I think we could cross this way. Let's see if we could cross this way. No, we can't. I thought there was a exit. So that, oh, is that right there that I'm looking at? I actually have to go. Okay, there's the Hunter's Lodge right there. Oh, do we have to be careful of these? No. You know what? Let's do this too. Uh, where's the filters? Filters. Uh, looking for fellowship. We can turn that off. All right.
hunting lodge. Come on. All right. I presume you're here to bring me ill news from town. You come from the town, do you? I have been watching from the bounds. The skies have turned dark and fell, and there is a shadow of unrest over all of Archet, over men and beasts and trees alike. Let me guess, my father has not the wisdom to observe such things, so you heard of his exiled son and came to me for aid. Come then, out with it. I desire to hear what you have to tell. So is this the heavy armor? Yep. So we'll finish that. Calder Kalbush and his true colors at last. Yep. I knew him to be evil-hearted, but my father is too trusting. He does not like to think ill of people. His blindness wounded me, but he is a good man. So to answer your questions, yes, I will come to Archit's aid. Uh, I and my fellows. I, I am a hunter and a skilled warrior trained by my father and captain, and I would rather die than sit idly by while foul brigands crash upon a decent people. Let us see what there is to see before the storm is upon us. While I gather my warriors and my weapons, you should sneak into Blackwood's roost and uncover their plan of attack for tonight. All right. We will do that. But first, we will equip our shoulder pads right there and then we'll go to our cosmetic outfit and put the our old shoulder pads on there we go put that down there all right uh, okay we could use some dodge I guess all right how long do they, these last? 20 minutes? All right, let me see. No other quests, right? All right. All right. Let's get those black walls. Blackwold's roots right here. See, right there. We'll see if we get around these guys. Let's go ahead. Oh, can't do that while running. All right. the plans right there. Letter inside the satchel tells that the Black Wolves mean to attack tonight with the help of Angmar. Oh my goodness. Well, we better get the leader. Let's get the leader. Where am I going? I need to go back that way. Oh, we'll go around. Alright, how many do I need? Two more?
believe there was one here. Well, I guess not. All right. Come on. Can't get over there. Ah, all right. Good work, my friend. And fast, too. This will be a great boon to our chat. Now we will be able to counter their efforts with the proper strategy. Is this the heavy armor? Heavy armor. I believe there is hope for us yet. What an... We only need a strategy. Yes. We'll go ahead and equip ourselves with that. And I'm not going to wear the hat because it hides my cute little ponytail. What an excellent find, Cobra Kai. These folk from Agmar sound like evil foes, but at least we know what we are up against. The plans also show a map that points to the Old East Path, which is just near here. We all avoid that path save for Alti Spiderbane, a visitor from east of, it, of the Misty Mountains. Speak with Alti and learn what he can tell you about the path. We can use the path to our advantage if we manage to successful, successfully scout it. Talk to Alti Spiderbane about the Old East Path. Okay. <clears throat> That's trash, right? And that was... Yeah, because I'm currently wearing... Oh. Yep. Keep it out there. All right. You have had a long day, friend, and more dangerous awake. You should take some rest. There is a bedroll just over there you can use. I will wake you if anything happens. All right. Sounds good to me. The bedroll is more comfortable than you expected, or perhaps you are more tired than you realize. You close your eyes, and before long, you are lost in dreams. Listen to my words. I am Galadriel, the Lady of the Golden Wood. Do not be afraid, my friend. Your people are short-lived, but the fate of Middle-earth is yours to command. I will not long disturb your sleep. I can visit you in dreams for only a short time. I have looked into my mirror and seen much that worries me. Let me show you.
I can beat him in a fight. You are near to wakefulness. The last tendrils of sleep will soon release you. You ask why I wanted to show you this? It is for one reason. I saw you in my mirror. Not once or twice, but often. Whether you desire it or not, your fate is tied to that of Middle Earth. Do not forget my words when you awaken. The free peoples of Middle Earth will have need of you. You must not fail them. That's right, I will fight evil with no mercy. Evil is the enemy. And the enemy deserves no mercy. All right. That sounds the most curious dream. I never have dreams like that, friend. I would not wish to have such. You mean it's not the bedroll? Okay. Let's talk to Alti Spiderbane. At your service and your family. Ah, I know all about the oldies path. There are spiders everywhere. When you kill one, another takes its place. If we are to make use of the path at all, we should fight our way through and ensure that it is still blocked at the walls of our chat. The spiders will do some work for us against the black wolves. And what the spiders don't deal with, we shall come from afore and behind with our axes and our blades, and we will fall excuse me down fall upon them like a mighty cave coming down okay so we need to investigate see if the wall is still there Do I have anything to equip? No. Okay. Alrighty. So all these guys are yellow, so I don't have to fight them. I do have to do four. So we will do that after we investigate. Okay, 
Pennsylvania, the pre against Galmez Doom at the dead end of Old Beach pa East Path. Tree panel and outfits. Yep. Okay. And we'll do one more. Oh, and I got this guy now. Hurl object. So that's a good uh, range. They talked. Oh, return to John Brackenbrook. With the whole full news, okay. <clears throat> oh, can't go that way. Oh, I guess I could. Okay. That end will surely work in our favor. Yep. Uh, okay, and the brigands will be slowed, and they will have the spiders at their heels, and the hunters will come from behind while the soldiers attack at the head. I will go to Archit to rally them and ready them for the storm that awaits them tonight. Okay, so we get some dyes. I'll do the rust dyes. I think rust looks like a good, good color. Quickly. Calder Cobb is making his move against Archet, and Wicked Men of Angmar are leading him, and the Black Wolf Strength. We must go to the town's defense at once. Return to me when you are prepared. And this is it. This is it, because once we finish the uh, intro, you become a novice, and that's when you could use the writing skill. All right. Just received your the final quest in the introduction quest series. If you have any other quests underway, we should complete them now. Nope, we don't have any other quests. Oh, well, thank you. Yeah, this is the quest log. Let me see. Nope, just this. So let's do it. We're going to talk to John Brackenbrook. Oh, what's this? Oh, come on. All right. So this is the trade tree. We're going to do Maelstrom. I have no points anyway, so I don't know why. Okay, anyway, what's this? I'll keep those there for now. All right, let's do this. I'm ready to go. This quest is the final quest in the introduction. If you have any other quests underway, you should complete them now, as these quests will no longer be available after the introduction is completed. Let's do it. John Brackenbrook and his hunters have reached the outskirts of Archit to find it already ablaze. A desperate struggle to save their village is about to begin. Hopefully, you have arrived in time. We have no time to lose. Already the town burns. We have only a short time to rest here before they see that we have broken through the east wall. I fear we are less safe by the moment. We must save Ned. Come on, get him. Jeez, that was some leg. Come on. Jeez. Empty here. 
Amdir's close by. He escaped the slaughter at the Badger. You have to help him. Defend the Badger. Those black wolves want the Hobbit and the Captain. I saw something in the flames. Go after them. You must save them. All right. Our chat must still be saved. Calder Cobbs and Otto's treachery were just the beginning of this battle, I fear. We must find a way to the Madge Badger Inn. Peg has left us a way into the marketplace. Perhaps there is a way in through there. Follow me. There are more up ahead. We must find my father before it's too late. The marketplace is safe for now, but we must press on. If we tarry too long, we will lose all of our chin. We must find another way into the center of town. Look, Otley is ahead. All must not be lost. Well met, friend. Is the crafting hall safe? Mad Badger burns. I still hold out hope. You have fared well, my friend, but all might be lost nonetheless. We have protected the market square and the crafters area. Already the Mad Badger burns. Perhaps my father is still alive, but I hold little hope. Follow Alti and me. We will defend what is left of this town to the dead if we must. Father, I knew you would survive. There goes Amdir. Ah, oh, poor Captain Kraken. Oh, no! Let's get him. He's toast now. Misery has befallen us. This is a My sad. My father was right to trust no one. 
This is a sad day indeed. Our chet is burned, my father is dead, and the ranger was taken by evil men. If men they can be called. Now we all we can do is wait for the flames to die down. Then with luck we may begin to rebuild our poor town. What tragedy has befallen us this night? But we defeated the black wood menace. I think it will be long ere they grow so bold again, with or without the help of the evil masters from Agmar. With the Black Wolves' attack foiled, the people of Archit have begun to rebuild. Yet not all hurts are so easily mended. The fate of the Ranger Umbria remains uncertain and may have dire consequences for Breland. But hope remains that he may yet be saved. The loss of my father is a painful one, but my pain is no greater than any other here in Archet. The people of Archet regard you as a hero, and I agree with them, Cobra Kai. Without your quick thinking, we would have lost more lives. You were the one who faced down the evil men and drove them, and many of the black wolves from the wo woods surrounding our town. We owe you much. It is good to know that the grim, dark growing across the land will have such fierce adversaries as yourself. You just received a milestone skill. Da -da -da. I received new mail. Okay. And reputation. All right. So let's see here. Okay. All right. Oh, we got a little present. We got to detach the present. We take this letter to Constable Thistlewood, and we get some goodies. Okay. So this is a gift pack, minimal level five. We're level six, so we get a bunch of goodies there. And then this level six. There we go. And this one need level seven so make sure you open this every level so you get some goodies here so let's start this quest we'll deliver the letter to constable thistlewood okay <clears throat> what's is that the letter ah i should have read it deliver letter of thanks yep okay we'll do that Let's see what else John Could I speak with you a moment? Okay, this is the prologue, Burying the Dead. Okay, and as we prepare for the Blackwold assault and stood at the defense of Archet, many of the good folk of this town perished, both within the gates and beyond. The battle was great, but in the end, we defeated the Brigand's onslaught. Some of the good men who were lost still remain unburied. But the people of this town have their hands full with their own great losses. It would be our shame if those unburied bodies were dishonored by wild beasts. I would ask this one last favor of you. Seek out those poor men and grant them honor and death. Uh, Dirk Mudbrick fell at the sheep farm southwest of Archit. Nate Whisperwood died defending the Hunter's Lodge and Cal Springley's farmhand. Will Whitley perished in battle just to the west of Brown's Folly. So we will accept that. All right, here's Constable. So the letter, we deliver it here to Constable Thistlewool. Message of thanks. Greetings. Okay, I remember your face and your actions. You are a hero to us all. I will do what I can, though we do not have much to offer at the moment. Take these and then speak with me again to see what else I can offer you. So you get these tokens of salutation. Okay, and transfer to your wallet. Okay, and he has another quest, Disease Among the Boars. So basically, okay, ah, fine day to you. It's good to see the backs of the Blackwolds broken and peace selling 
Over. Arsha once more. Now we can concern ourselves with less dire problems. Actually, you might be able to help with one of these problems if you are interested. These seem to be an illness spreading among the local boars and a terrible affliction it must be for the beasts are more hostile than normal. We really must put an end to this illness and the only way is to slay those afflicted. Would you do this? Yes. Alright, so let's look at the goodies we could get. The barter items. Greetings. Alright. So, I like this one, the Novus Mark. Uh, it's a pocket item. We get 5 plus out of combat run speed. So we'll take that, barter that. And there it is. We're going to equip it in our pocket. And now we can run a little faster. And then I'm going to take two of these. Okay. And that's it. And then, you know what? I also want to I'll loot these. Can I sell them to this guy? I don't know. How can I be of service? Nope. Nope. Can't do that. Let me see. And then we'll see what Alti Spider Bane will do. Come and stay a moment. A threat from spiders. Don't worry about me, Cobra Kai. It's just a minor wound I got in the fighting. Now that the Brackenbrook's father and son have driven the black wolves away from Archie, perhaps these folks can get to living their lives as they once did. Word has reached me, though, that there's a new threat to be dealt with. A nearby farm has been overrun with spiders, and the folk there have retreated to Archette. My, near, my injury prevents me from dealing with the pests, but you have proven yourself a capable warrior and should have no trouble. Look for the farmer here in Archette. You may know him already. His name is Cal Springley. Okay, we'll do that. And there he is there. Oh, come on. Come on. How can I be of service? And I can't even move. How can I be of service? All right. There we were, ready to stand our ground against the black wolf villains when these monstrous spiders came pouring up from the cellar in the middle of the night. It seems hardly fair. Still, if the spider bane sent you, it could be you'll be able to help us out. Our farm is due south of Brown's Folly. If you can, recover my seed bag from the pens, my strong box from the storage shed. We could make a new start of it. Oh, and my father's bow as well. Poor Henry was trying to kill some of the spiders with it. He was a good hand, but the spiders made quick work of the lad. Hurry back if you can. Though with all the spiders around my farm, I don't see how you will. Okay. Let's sell our stuff. What can I do for you? Okay, copper band. Sell. Okay, we got a little instructions on fitting yourself and others. Oh, the this that's crafting. Let's see. Do that. Sell. 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 <coughs> okay. Yeah, that's pretty much everything I want to sell. What's this? Wrapped horse wrestle. No special passage. Alright, this is for Cobra Kai, the Crafting Guilds of Middle Earth. Thank you for all that you have done for the free peoples that would like to extend an invitation to speak with our representative Jill Brushwood at the Craft Hall in the Village of Combe. We acknowledge your ability as a combatant and invite you to try your hand at a less violent form of work, craftsmanship. 
you will find that Jill Brushwood is an able teacher and a uh, uh, is an able teacher who can introduce you to pursuits of ranging from cooking to scullery to smithy and everything in between. Sincerely, the Crafting Guilds of Middle Earth. So visit Jill Brushwood, the mistress of princes at the Craft Hall in Combe. Okay, we're not going to go to Combe just yet. We'll remove that. Got some stuff to do around here. But we will do that next time. Uh, we'll probably do this first. Yeah. Probably do the prologue first. Okay. So we're going to call that quits for today. Thank you for watching. If you like the video, please feel free to hit that like, subscribe, and bell notification. And leave some comments on how you're enjoying the brawler, if you're playing the brawler, or what your impression of it is. Um, and, you know, uh, and drop a comment on whatever you want. So, all right. So we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching and take care.